Hi, I'm Andy. Do you like ping pong? Do you like tournaments? If so, you will love what we have in store for you. The championship matches for the 2015 Digital Guardian Ping Pong Tournament, presented by the DGPA. Three championship final matches will be played, three divisional crowns will be awarded. Here's the lineup. First up will be our opening match, the Newbie Division Finals. History will be made as a title will go to a non-Digital Guardian employee for the first time in tournament history. Will it be the challenger seed, Mass Medical Zone, Bonnie Cooper? She has already made tournament history by becoming the first women player to ever reach the finals in any division. Or will the title go to undefeated seed, Mass Medical Zone, Joshua Kim? Joshua won their earlier encounter in the tournament and will be looking to repeat to take the title. Whatever the outcome, Mass Medical will walk away with their first ever title in the tournament. Next up will be the Intermediate Division Finals. It will be Professor vs. Protégé, Mentor vs. Mentee, and a rematch of last year's finals. The number two seed and reigning champion is Cam Patel. He will face his mentor and number one seed holder, Mike Foresto. Many observers feel the two are evenly matched, making this an exciting contest. Will Cam claim his second consecutive title, or will he be schooled by Foresto? Finally, we will conclude with the Expert Division Finals. The challenger seed is Joe Zhu, who has surprised many observers by going from a complete unknown to a number one contender. He will face reigning two-time champion Mukesh Chowdhury. Mukesh has not lost a match in the three-year history of this tournament. Will Joe hand Mukesh his first ever defeat, or will Mukesh 3 p And will Ruben come back in time from his business trip to watch these championship matches in person? The answer to these questions and more is coming up next. And welcome to our coverage of the 2015 Digital Guardian Ping Pong Tournament presented by the DGPA. For the first time in tournament history, our coverage will also be streamed live on Twitch TV and on YouTube. This is our third annual competition, which formerly ran under the old moniker of the Vertices March Madness Ping Pong Tournament. I am your host, Andrew Wollen, joined in the booth with sports analyst Howard Cassell. Our tournament coverage will feature the championship matches for the newbie, intermediate, and expert divisions. We begin with our opening match, the newbie division finals. Eleven competitors competed in the newbie division. Now only two remain. Let's meet the finalists. Action. Bonnie Cooper, Brandeis University, Massachusetts Medical Society. Joshua Kim, East Summer Community School, 6th grade champion. So Howard, you have watched these players participate in the tournament. As they warm up, is there anything in particular that you can tell us? What I can tell you is this. To this point, all matches were played in the game room, which had a tiled floor surface. Today the competition's being held in a carpeted conference room. Our competitors had become accustomed to the low friction tiled floor. The carpeting is slowing down their footwork, making their movements appear stiff. Without a doubt, the player who is able to adapt will clearly have the edge. Hmm. You raise a good point, Howard. It will be interesting to see how the carpeted surface will impact the other competitors. Let's now go over the rules for the newbie division. The contest will be decided in the best of three games format, meaning the player that first wins two games will be declared the winner. A game is decided by whoever reaches 21 or more points first, with at least a two point margin of victory. Scoring is handled using traditional ping pong rules. Players are to switch sides after each game. Players are to switch service duties after five serves. And since this is the newbie division, Slamming the ball is prohibited. The receiver will receive a point on such violations. 
The scorekeeper for this match is William Oliver. And we are ready to begin. The players will volley to decide who serves first. Come on, guys. Bicycle now. Let's see bicycle. Are we good? We're good We're now. We're now live. All right. This is for that. Serve. All right. in this league. Oh. So what do you do? You lose. But that was like a slow motion. <laughs> that was a slam. <laughs> it's 
no slamming so a newbie bracket. Yeah, sorry. Right. So what's the call? So, so Bonnie gets the point. So how fast does the ball have to go? Well, that was a. It's oh, yes, sir. Uh, so hold on. on. It was 14. So it's 14, 18. We found the other stone ball. Why did we do that over? Who's who serving? Do you, you want to do it over? Yeah, yeah, do it over. You, you were serving. Yeah. Yeah. So, so wait, so you guys do it over. So yeah. 14, 17. Okay, right. do the point over. The new scorekeeper is ping pong professional Ilya Leven. Thank you. 
this stream the computer crashed. Nice job. Where's the AC in the start over? It's start over. Give me one minute. All right. Talk to our YouTube people. And TV. All right, good. We had a blue screen on the live feed, so um, Josh and Bonnie continue their second match. It's now tied one game to one. They will now play the third exciting match right now. The final game? Yeah, the, yeah best of three for newbie bracket.
Oh. Seven from the And so, Joshua Kim defeats Bonnie Cooper two games to one. Coming up next, an interview with the champ himself. So Joshua Kim, you have just won the newbie division of the 2015 Visual Guardian Ping Pong Tournament. You are also the first mass medical employee to take the titles from any division. What are your thoughts on about winning the division and becoming the first med mass medical employee ever to win this tournament? In this tournament, I just want to say thanks for inviting him. <laughs> thanks for Bonnie for being awesome, and giving an intense game. Uh, what was that? Yeah, no, good, yeah. Need a towel. Need a towel. What was your overall approach in tackling this tournament? Approach. What you want to force go? Let a force come. Yeah. Yep. Right from the champ. And then uh, the Olympics. Mm -hmm. That's about it. So Forrest Gump in the Olympics. Right. You're eating a lot of ice cream. cream. And eating a lot of ice cream. Yep. That's, that's how I train. Train power. A lot of dare. <laughs> okay. You faced your competitor, Bonnie Cooper, once before in the tournament. Did you do anything different for your second matchup? And hang out a little bit. No, I just tried to stay positive, you know. Oh, my coach told me back in sixth grade. What did he say? Uh, hit the ball, Josh. Hit the ball, Josh. Hit the ball. Okay, so you did hit the ball. Sometimes I did, yeah. Sixty percent of the time it worked. All the time. Okay. The championship match was played on carpeted flooring instead of tiles. Did this affect your gameplay at all? Yeah, it's like going from U.S. Open to like. France, French Open, yeah, a little. Actually, it wasn't a sliding, it was slippery. Feels different. It's more slippery on the carpet. No, 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 it wasn't slippery. Actually. Oh, was it? Was, it was, the, was the opposite, actually. So diving to the table is kind of painful. I don't know. I think I get some scars. Yeah. Can you show the scar to the camera? <laughs> no, it's okay. It's not that bad. Okay. Were you aware that there was another Joshua Kim plane in the newbie bracket? And if so, were you disappointed that two of you never got to play against each other? He's probably my other brother that never met, but no, I have not met Joshua Kim. Really? Does he work here? Yes, he works here. Oh, wow. I've never met him. Oh, maybe we should, I should introduce <laughs> you to him after we're done here. Yeah. So uh, thank you, Joshua, for taking the time to speak with us after your exciting win over Bonnie Cooper. Thank you for having me. Alright. This tournament is brought to you by Digital Guardian, bridging the gap between system security and endpoint protection. And by the media team at VertusSoftball.com, as mentioned in the Wall Street Journal, providing coverage of amateur sporting events since 2004. On the web at VertusSoftball.com. Coming up will be our next match, the Intermediate Division Finals. You can view this contest in part two of our tournament coverage. We hope you will join us.